What's up guys, it's DJNX here, back making a video about AirMac. So, I'm finally able to connect with someone on the co-op. So, uh, we're pretty much um, going to uh, kill the opposing team. So, as you guys can see here, we are uh, doing the uh, Blitzkrieg kind of operation. If you may. Um, so, this guy just went... And um, just tons of units right there. So we are in a co-op. So this is the first time that I'm doing the co-op thing, okay? So if you guys didn't know that, uh, it's pretty awesome. So let's see uh, what will happen. So I have a different color, so I'm not using the blue one. I don't know why though. Uh, but I think it's really cool that I have a different color right here. I think you guys might agree with that. Different color, it looks cool. The orange and black. Kind of like, looks like a... Uh, what do you call this? It's like a uh, danger sign or something. What the fuck? <laughs> so that was quick as hell. Okay, so uh, let's see if we can do one again. Uh, yeah, let's go with random map. So that guy went random. Uh, don't really know what to do there. Oh, the guy is level 45, so he's pretty strong. His name is uh, Akahitomi. Okay, so it turned blue. Let's see. Uh, let me just change some things here. So let's use the ultimate guy right here. So yeah, I think that would pretty much be uh, enough. Okay. Mm. All right, so um, another match. Wow, I don't know what kind of um, what kind of jet that is. I think that one is the bomber. So uh, again, we're going with the blitzkrieg kind of formation or tactic. It's pretty popular here. These guys build their tanks so, so fast. I have no idea how they're doing that. Or um, maybe it's because of um, the uh, bonus or of the level. Because uh, I'm only at level 7, I think, or I'm not sure. Okay, so let's support our troops here. We're gonna, we're gonna end this thing really fast. As you guys can see right here. Damn, that shit is fast as hell. Okay, so it turns out you, you need to be at a certain level so you'll be able to um, play the co-op as well. So first you need to to do the, um, well, what is this again? You need to do the, the skirmish first. And then you can kind of play the co-op and then um, the co-op and then after the co-op you can play the uh, PvP. So it's like a step-by-step um, -step progress. So uh, as you guys can see, he has items that I have no idea of what, is, what it does.
Okay, so we're gonna start another match. So this is co-op game number three, okay? And I think it's gonna end really fast again. So we're going against some two players called uh, the the their names was Natasha or something. This guy's just standing there. I don't know what he's thinking about. Okay, so it has started. Uh, I think he's going defensive. Uh, I'm just gonna go and um, use the Blitzkrieg once again. I'm not sure if this will be effective at this match. But I, I don't know. We're gonna take chances. Okay, so our enemy is Mako and Natasha. I don't know if those are bots or what. I don't know if they're bots, but I have a feeling that they're not. Okay. So uh, yeah. Anyways, if you want to select multiple uh, multiple allies or multiple units, you need to hold down on the control button, so that will automatically light up the um, all the units that you're gonna pass through. Okay, so yeah, uh, and also if you get a certain distance from them, uh, it will lose the uh, the select option or the highlight, the purple, the purple, um, the purple light. So yeah. I almost died there, so I'm running out of energy. I don't know what this guy is doing, but whatever it is, it's not working, or it's not helping me at uh, um, any way. So uh, let's let's just use the ultimate Chaco. So uh, they seem to be really effective. But yeah, um, I'm probably gonna play the co-op a little bit more so that I can level up and actually show you guys um, what the PvP looks like or feels like. Uh, maybe that will interest you guys into playing this game. And uh, yeah, so we just need to build a few more tanks. They are clearing out my other tanks right there. If you guys can see on the radar. I know if you guys can see that clearly. But yeah, I have a feeling that they are clearing that up. So uh, let's just spam units here. This guy right here, my ally, is just freaking standing there and doing nothing yeah basically he's doing nothing at all okay now he has some units set up there and I'm gonna launch an attack see if this one works and I'm also building uh, buster tanks You are in the mix with DJ Red. So it's taking a while. Okay. I don't know what this guy is doing. He's just repairing broken stuff. 
Okay, now we're moving. We're moving. And uh, we basically just need to build some more troops. Okay, so we got two more there. And uh, we're gonna drop it off near uh, the other guys. Hopefully that helps us. And now this one. Okay, just clear out this base. And now we deliver. Okay, so we are now on the base of the enemy, main base. So uh, we're pretty much going to win. Okay, okay he died right there. Alright, so we won! Okay, win online match. So there you go, that proves that it is online. I'm also now level 7. So uh, I'm guessing I need to get to level 10 uh, for me to play the PvP. I am not sure. Okay. But yeah, uh, you guys have seen me play three games, you know, three quick games on co-op. So that pretty much gives us an idea of how things are really fast or how the battle goes when um, you are playing with other players, okay? So we've actually unlocked the saucer, so let's check that out real quick before uh, we go. The saucer, okay. Alright, we got the bomber. Abilities, bombs, drop bombs while in the air mode to pulverize enemy units on the ground. Allows your mech to fire a projectile that does massive damage to the enemy ground units. Okay. So uh, yeah, we're gonna buy him, you know, just for flexibility of our um, lineup. Also, if I haven't shown you guys yet, you can you can buy basically more slots on your um, what do you call this on your hanger. Okay, so uh, hmm, we need to find out uh, how I did that. I kind of forgot how I did that. Uh, live long and prosper card. And then with legendary actor Leon and Nimoy. Uh, what the hell does that do? Okay. Common capsule. Keys. Uh, okay. So uh, the loadout slot actually is the item that you need to do to add more profiles okay so as you can see I only have three um, we go to the items in the other section and then um, we buy that okay, okay might take a second okay we are done now you guys can see I now have four okay now what we can do here is click this button so that actually allows us to change the air mech. So now I have the um, the the one that that we just bought the uh, bomber uh, equipped. Okay, so let's rename this uh, game TV. Okay, so uh, we got um, Stage X, Lady Booby, YouTube, Game TV. Okay. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And um, since we leveled up, let's check if we can buy new units. So uh, go to the store, I mean the shop, and just click the unit button. You'll, you'll probably see it there. Um, we got different kinds of um, units here. Anti, uh, this is anti-air mech stuff. Oh, they got. Okay, we can actually use this. Buy this now. But we don't have the uh, the money though. We can use this one. Yeah, let's just buy that one because I can't afford to top up that one. Uh, leveler, what does this do? A supercomputer that assists in a rapid uh, permutation of all battle outcomes and levels up the air mechs on your team faster as a result. 
Be careful when using as they need to be on a socket to work. Okay, it levels up your air mech faster. I don't see how that is important. Okay, the SAM. Surface to air missile infantry. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna need that. Cutling gun with a high rate of fire. Okay, so this is um, a good defense or offensive structure. So the reason why I said offensive is um, remember the fact that you can carry structures. So yeah, you can carry them and then just basically drop them um, near your enemy base. So when your enemy soldier spawns, you can kill them as soon as they come out. So yeah, just make sure that you place them somewhere um, that their defensive structures can't hit it. So yeah, we have here hero. Aerial support unit, when deployed, this flying unit will automatically heal any damage units or air mechs within its range. So that's pretty good. Well, yeah, let's buy him. And uh, yeah, I think we'll pretty much stop there because we're not that rich here. Um, let's see, something that we can look forward to will be the Aegis. This looks badass. Sophisticated and efficient missile defense turret. Okay, so uh, yeah, we'll, we'll definitely get Aegis here and uh, HAAT. Damn, look at those guns. Yeah, we're pretty much gonna buy that. So yeah, that pretty much um, ends the video. You've seen me uh, play three quick games with the co-op. So yeah, uh, if you like the video guys, give it a thumbs up. If you guys dislike it, give it a thumbs down, okay? Um, either way, it's all very welcome to me and very much appreciated. I love you guys so much. Thank you for all the support. Thank you for watching the videos. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care and peace out.